Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are in the kitchen. If you've seen the other Trez Appetite videos I did, I did specifically one on dining out on Trez Appetite. This one is dining in. I have documented a week's worth of dinners, all made at home. If you've never seen any of my other kitchen videos, I love to cook, I'm a big cook. But if you've seen my health journey, that kind of stuff videos, I have made some significant changes to our meal planning this year on account of all my hormone stuff. So this is a video of a week of dinners all made at home and all in what we would call maybe a lower carb category. I would never call this keto, definitely not. I'm also not somebody who tracks like specific nutrition in food, mainly because we have two girls that are 10 and 12. And the last thing I will ever do is give them any sort of disordered eating. So I do this mainly for my own health. And since I'm the one that cooks in the house, we're all eating it. But you'll see there's definitely carbs involved. It's not no carb or anything like that. There's a bit of a range that we work through. But I thought it'd be helpful since we did the dining out video to have a companion one where we dined in. Let me know if you like these videos. Let me know if you wanna see more like monthly what I eat in a day. They tend to be, you know, a bit seasonal, but also I, I do the dance. So sometimes I really love to cook and make a three hour dinner and sometimes I don't. So let me know if you're interested in more of this content. And yeah, let's dive right in. So the first thing I did was make a chipotle bowl kind of thing. It's like a chipotle chicken bowl. I don't know. We don't eat chipotle ever. So it's my take on it. I marinated the chicken in a whole bunch of herbs. Uh, let me tell you, this turned out really well. I did uh, basmati rice, a ton of it with greens, avocado, creme fraiche or sour cream, whatever floats your boat, pico, cheese, and the chicken. I made a ton of that rice because I had leftover the next day for, I made this broccoli and chicken stir fry and I topped it with sesame seeds. It was really quick, really good. It's a great like 30 minute dinner. The next day I made, this is like one of my new go-tos. It's basically like stuffed nachos, but you use peppers instead of tortilla chips. I put chorizo, again, I do a ton of different like spices and stuff on it, but you top it with cheese. I do no cheese on some of them for one of the girls and then creme fraiche or sour cream and avocado. This is so good. This night I made a salad. I made, I like this kind of bistro salad. I did a bacon wrapped chicken and I air fried it. And then I made a dressing out of a white wine vinegar out of bacon fat, out of honey mustard, and then I tossed that in the greens. I cooked extra bacon and I chopped it up on top, and then I, you know, I sliced the chicken and the bacon, topped it on top of the salad. Oh my God, this is so yummy. And it's just a really great like bistro kind of vibe. My next night I made stuffed shells. I just sauteed up some onions, garlic, and added, I don't know, all kinds of stuff to it. I made a the stuffed ricotta, what was it, ricotta, parmesan, egg, a few other things, spinach. <laughs> I'm one of those cooks where I just kind of throw stuff in. Everything's a little different every single time. But it's basically similar to making lasagna, a little less time, but similar kind of concept. Boiled the shells, let them cool, stuffed them with the mixture. It was actually really good. We had a lot left over, so uh, that was lunch the next day. The thing that I like about making these kind of meals, look how good that, oh, dude, that was really good. This gives you enough to where you can have leftovers the next night. So this was, this was great. And then we're concluding with taco salad, which is, this is like how I get dinner on the table in less than 30 minutes. I literally toss greens into salsa as a, for a dressing, ground beef or whatever you wanna do, and then however you wanna top it, go for it. It's dead simple, everybody can customize it. And when you're having one of those days, dinner's on the table in 30 minutes. So I hope this video was helpful. Let me know if you have any questions, any other video ideas, and thanks so much for watching y'all. Bye.